hi guys let us understand how to make a custom tag I mean how we can make our own tag and we'll have some functionality right so what we'll do here we'll just say right click and new project dynamic B project and I'll give a name here like ZSP with custom tags okay select the version here and then say next and finish it and we'll create one class here okay and here we'll go to and we'll make one JSP page say here new file and say index dot JSP okay and then I'll make a new file and I'll say here my tag dot JSP. We need to make one TLD file here. So we'll just say here new file. Say something you can give uh, abc.tld. Okay. Right. Finish it. Come to the source here now. Now in the index. I'll just say here anchor I'll not do anything href equal to my tag dot JSP okay click here to get custom tag okay so this page will come now this page will call my tag dot JSP. So here we'll call the tag. How we can call the custom tag? Percent at the rate tag leave. Okay. Percent at the rate tag leave equal to. Sorry. Tag leave URI equal to. What is the custom tag? Means TLD file name. I give an ABC dot TLD. Remember right? So we have to give a if it is a path under some folder just give the full path here and I say prefix equal to X or S okay close it now at any point of time you can write what S colon the tag name say here just I say CRT or Okay, copyright. Let us say copyright. Okay. So I'm just making an empty tag here. So once I say tag leave URI ABC dot TLD and then prefix S so it should be prefix here right now abc.tld I have made I'll tell you what is this we'll make one handler class tag handler class so I'll say here new and I'll give a class name here just make a package first package is com.example finish it and then I'll say right click and I'll say new uh, class here okay I'll give a class name copyright copyright tag finish it so this is the code I have written I have just code for the tag handler now I tell you what you will do now so here we are having copyright tag class right copyright tag good we are extending a simple tag support actually there is a one tag interface okay from this tag interface two classes is drive like tag support and body tag support if you want to make a body tag container tag you can extend this body tag support or uh, there's a simple tag support also so we can extend and we can make a tag handler 
so we have to override this method like do uh, start tag and do end tag here we are writing jsp writer dot get jsp context dot get dot so i'm obtaining this auto object and then we're writing auto dot print line so i can say 2010 and 2012 some copyright information so it is say isaac software okay now so once the tag call it will call this tag handler class and as the tag start tag in content this method will call and display this message okay now here we have to mention the abc dot tld we have to write some mapping in that so let us say this tag now so what we are doing here, this is like just a mandate you have to write this descriptions and all like what version of tagli we are using, what version of uh, what is the URI, something like that, JSP version, okay. Now what is the name of tag? So what tag name I have given? Copyright, right? So here I will write here, I will give you the name copyright copy right okay what is the class you have tag class so com dot example dot copyright tag right this is my class and body content type is what empty because we are not writing a container tag we are writing empty tag so if writing empty tag you have to write empty if it is a container tag you have to write jsp here in a seed of this you have to write JSP, okay? So it's done now. So once we call this page, it is calling my tag dot JSP. My tag is calling this tag. This tag is where it is in ABC dot TLD, right? So it will go to the ABC dot TLD, and it will look for this tag, and then it will call this class. And in this class, it will call this method, and it will display this message, okay? So let us try to deploy now. So this is the link, click it here. Okay guys, so here I just uh, have a mistake here. I'll just say here and then I'll go to here and I'll say refresh it, right? And then I can click, I'll get the copyright information, right? So this output is coming from a tag, which we have mentioned here, right? As copyright. So that's all about the custom tag.